This newsletter post is based on my book insight of Thomas Stanley's The Millionaire Next Door. So please check out that video. It's a lot more in depth in terms of saving money and why it's important to save because this is a message to the people that don't really like to save much money or don't really understand the concept behind saving and its purpose. And Thomas Stanley, who studied extensively other people and, and how they managed to keep so much wealth, what methods they use to keep that money and how they keep a, a positive cash flow. And some of the things it goes into is saving money regularly, investing wisely and living below your means. It highlights how the rich stay rich and that you don't necessarily need to spend lots of money when you are rich. Many, many of the millionaires studied within the book live within their means and use methods to keep the riches they earn rather than spending new ways to spend it recklessly. So they, they, use, they, they look for ways to, to save more money and make more money as opposed to spend more money. It mentions that people who prioritize social status over financial status will not be wealthy long term. And the people that are referred to in the social status are the people that find ways to look more rich than they, than they are. So they buy more expensive things, which is at the cost of their, of their financial stability, very reckless, very irresponsible. And the people that are looking for financial status are people that understand that balance between I need to I need to make more than I spend in order to keep what I have. And they, they keep that balance. They have those limits and they understand that that relationship. So they keep that money long term. Adopting a small amount of frugality helps you save more money. And this helps you for rainy days, special occasions or investments that interest you. Yeah, exactly. You don't need to be completely frugal. If you, if you're someone who likes things more expensive or whatever the case may be, you need to f you need to find a compromise. You need to find the compromise between either I can spend more, but I have to make more, or I might have to sacrifice a few things in order to still make more than what I spend. Because I think the the entire idea behind the spending, saving, and and financial stability in general is learning how to make more money than how much you spend. How much is your your net worth at the end of the month, for example, or how much how much money have you spent over how much you've made in, in that month? And that's an important number to know. You should know those figures because that helps you know whether you're going to be financially stable within, within the next few years. This is the advice, and this is something that I read at the time. I feel like a lot of my newsletter posts moving forward from the 7th of February are going to be quite short and quite um, dense and not, not really a lot of, of content to cover but hopefully I can make some short videos out of these. These are sort of the you know snappy quick reminders on few important topics that we have in life and I give I give something in, at the, the bottom there that you should at least look to look to aim look stuff with like 10% if you can't do 10% of your earnings and, you know, break it down to 1% if you have to, but start off somewhere, save some amount of money. And once you start, you'll pick up the habit and hopefully it could be, it could be something you build on from there. And it's not, you're not going to save the money for when you die, because once you die, that money goes. But even if it's not for you, consider saving money for your family, for people that would need it, some, some generous charity you can do those kind of things, or if not, you can save it for your own investments that you want to make, things that you want to purchase later down the line. And it's a good way to start thinking about how you can save or how you can spend less money than how much you're making. Hope this is beneficial.